In your school watch, Pueblo School District 60 prepared this year for drug overdoses just in case. D60 nurses, including some at the middle school level, taking part in Narcan training this summer. New side Sam Kramer in our Pueblo studio tonight and Sam experts say this is just a sign of the times. Yeah, to be clear, the district has never had an incident like this, but equipping nurses with the knowledge and proper drugs like Narcan to respond, they're placing a major emphasis on safety. From police officers on campus to locked doors and secure entries, Pueblo School District 60 has an obvious focus on safety. We want to take every precaution possible um, to protect our students in the event that um, something drastic happens. And this summer they took it a step further. Some D60 nurses now know how to administer the emergency medication known as Narcan or Naloxone. As seen in this training video, it's sprayed directly into someone's nose to counteract an opioid overdose. And according to Dr. Michael Nirenberg, it's a threat even to students in junior high. We know there's kids in, in middle school using and so they too deserve a chance to live. Nuremberg is president of the board of directors for the Southern Colorado Harm Reduction Association. Even though the opioid epidemic is felt nationwide, he says it's particularly prevalent in Pueblo. We are one of the worst areas of the state in terms of use. Um, we are one of the highest uh, in terms of per capita overdoses. And while the district has never had an overdose, prevention is all about preparedness. But in the event that we do, even if we can just save one life, we believe the measure is worth it. Now the Narcan supply is provided through a state grant to the Harm Reduction Association, but then makes this training available to anyone. News 5's Colette Borderline is taking a closer look at this life-saving drug. Whether it's enabling drug users, that's Thursday night at 10. For now, always watching out for you, Pueblo. Sam Kramer, News 5.